Hey guys, welcome back to some more Diddy Kong Racing. We got one more person joining us for this one. Hey guys, SexDude26 here. And why are you a different character? Each episode I'm going to be swapping up so I get to show off all the characters, even the two unlockable ones. Who's this guy? This one... I'm drawing a blank for his name. Some... Yeah, this is Bumper. Thanks for that. I'm drawing a blank because it's not like I haven't played this game in two years. <laughs> I was but, kind yeah. of honestly thinking back to Pinkhole's LP. It's like, Bumper! Yeah, there you I go. I love playing this Bumper. <laughs> hey, Bumper is pretty good, though. That LP was just ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, it was. Damn you, Michael Bolton! <laughs> that and the Lion King references were good. I need to go yeah. back and watch those. So, this is one of the first little battle games we had to do. The point of this is to collect three eggs. Once they hatch, mm -hmm. you can't steal them from the bases, but you can steal eggs from other people's bases before they hatch. You'll know if they hatch or not when the egg is solid on their icon. If they're blinking like they are now in like Diddy's, for example, then I could steal it. Because damn you, Michael Bolton! Pretty much. And you won! Now you do have to do all these battle games in order to actually get to the the final boss, basically, of the story. Well, not I, I wouldn't say the true final boss, we'll see that one later. But you need to do these, because that's how you unlock it. For a second there, I literally thought that Taj was going to be like, here's your prize, have this balloon that you can't even use. Have another balloon. You don't need the main piece of the amulet here or anything, just have another balloon. How many do you, of these do you have? Oh, you have to collect Yeah, it tells more. you right on the screen. Okay. Yeah, so you do need all these. This will unlock the, the final boss, so you do have to do these. God damn. You do have to beat the bosses twice, though, in order to get to the first boss. The first final boss. It sounds so confusing when you say it that way, when there's like two endings of a game. But it is the case. God, God damn bug paying attention mechanics. And now we gotta collect God silver damn points. Silver coin challenge. This is where the second difference of mirror mode comes in, because in mirror mode they actually move the placement of some of these coins, so they do appear in different places. But that's the only okay. difference in mirror mode. I and also, got them all in the first yeah, one. Th this is the first race, oh so it, it makes sense. But most of the time, Flash. I will go on my way to go the get these coins in the first lap, because you do need to still win these races in first place to get the balloon, mm. to beat it. So I do my best and get them all in the beginning, and then just gun it for the end. Lester, let's be Fair honest enough. here. Let's be honest here. If you didn't do that, it, that was a reset, wasn't it? What do you mean? Getting all Dude, the coins in the exactly. first lap? Getting coins first lap. Not all the time, no. I mean, if I knew okay. it was a really difficult race, maybe, but this is the first race. This is nothing. I mean, look, I'm gonna lap drumstick right here. Lap the last four places. And see you later, Conker. <laughs> That's ridiculous. See you later, Conker. That's the advantage of green boost. If you don't hold the A button while you boost, you get a green boost, which is a slightly faster boost. So when you take those full boosts, that's a lot of speed. Okay, that's a useful balloon. That balloon is useful. For what? I cannot remember for the life of me. Unlocking levels, I think? Yeah, pretty much. As you can tell yeah, by the numbers on these doors, they count by the golden yeah, balloons. That's right. That's why you need to collect them all, because you need to have that certain amount to get into these levels. In the beginning, no, it's really nothing. It's just end games when you're really gonna need these. Are we on Dinosaur Planet? Well, this is the dino area, so close enough. Okay. This I believe canonically it's now called Jurassic World, Matt. <laughs> okay, Steven Spielberg. <laughs> By the way, I still need to see that movie. That. Yeah, yeah, same here. Because, yeah. like, the first Jurassic, War uh, Jurassic Park movie was like my idea of your perfection in a movie, so I kind of have really high quality uh, standards for this goddamn. Oh movie. yeah, it's been a while. Plus, not only that, the second and third one weren't. Yeah, they were all right. They were weren't anything bad. They were I watchable. I didn't, I didn't mind them personally. Okay. Yeah, I enjoyed them. Admittedly, I marathoned them all with my girlfriend. And it was funny because like I couldn't find the first one airing on TV for a while, but I've seen the second and third one appear so many times, so I've seen them before the first. 
I didn't like Lost World. I like I didn't mind three. I just didn't like Lost World as much. But Jeff Goldblum Matt. I in know. parkour. Wait, wrong Lost World. <laughs> yeah, that's Lester, the we're not getting to that game for a while, okay? Please. I totally should try it. We should totally record the 3DS version of that, though. Oh God. Okay, fine. Let me go get it because I'm the only one that has a 3DS capture card. And if you do it, make sure you show your your special stage attempts on camera. No, because that would be hilarious. No, no, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh yes. It's gonna be we running around the walls have... just to Matt get a chaos Cameron. emerald. Yeah, just some webcam footage of Matt like spinning and twirling around his room, just going, "Where's that bloody last last chaos emerald?" Well, not only that. I'd be freaking tripping over myself because got cords everywhere. Recording Get really sound. long cords. <laughs> okay, Lester. Okay. God damn it. Why did that game have gyro... I, I will never understand that to this day. Why he keeps gyroscope? I, I, I hate that for a handheld game only because you're always on the move with a handheld. So it gets even worse. I hate it on the Wii U. I don't like gyroscope. <laughs> And, when, and you're gonna love the new Star Fox game then. Because there's no way to turn it <laughs> off from what they're saying so far. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. They built the game around gyroscope from what I'm hearing, so... It's not sound like we can turn it off. It makes sense, but I would prefer to not have it be mandatory. Yeah, make it optional, like in yeah. Splatoon. Yeah, exactly, because it works so well there yeah. to be manual or just use to gyro. Yeah, exactly. Go for it. Go bumper, go bumper, go! He got all the silver Leave everyone in too. the dust because you always do that. Lester, now you're just showing off with the drifting. <laughs> well, you really need to drift around these corners, otherwise you're gonna be kind of drifting off to the side and hitting a wall. I'm watching how much Lester's drifting, and all it makes me think of is the beach level in Mario Kart 10. Oh no, Mario Kart 8. <laughs> oh Mario Kart yeah, it, makes me <laughs> it makes me do that beach zone from the game that doesn't exist. Oh shit. I've put all of the you games together. Fantastic. We've just jumped probably five years in the future. Now to go play some. Yay! Three. Five years? Try like two at this point. That wouldn't surprise me. Hey, Microsoft skips nine. Maybe Nintendo will. Oh god! We'll be able to play on, on uh, the Super Wii U. Now that we've <laughs> less than now that we finished our playthrough of Mario Party 10, oh Mario Kart 10, we can move on to our let's play of Resident Evil 9. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, well, Resident Evil 8's already <laughs> game remastered. Way out the window. I'm still waiting for the next movie in that series. <laughs> I was it was the Resident Evil movies even any good? Yeah, they're okay. <laughs> It depends on which it's, ones you're talking about, though. Because some people say the, some of them aren't that good. Don't expect it to be the same as the games. Yeah. Some, some are alright. Some of them are alright. Okay. Because right. yeah, I know I'll some people who only seen the movies, and they say they enjoy I, them. I've seen a couple of them before, and they're they're, they're okay. Not to say they're not the, the best, they're not the worst, I mean, but they're, they're decently good. Okay. Um, so I got enough coins, so I'm just going to go ahead and do this again. I'm not Lester. okay with this! <laughs> Lester, where are you going? <laughs> Out of going bounds. <laughs> I approve of this glitch. I'm gonna put the game. God damn it, Lester. Of course, this is Lester, though. If, yeah, just if just wait, the game will question the game. it. There you once go, the game's not questioning it. The, once you fly around like this, it makes all the lava just look like floating cheese. Yeah, that's why I like doing this, because the lava just doesn't look uh, right. It does I look pretty funny. I'm sorry, Floating cheese? Floating cheese slices, yeah. Uh, I am I, <laughs> am okay. I the only one that's listening to the music and hearing booty, 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 booty? No, because I hear uh, that all the time. You would be the one to bring that up, wouldn't you? I guess. <laughs> also, I did just fly dangerously close to that loading zone. If it went up anymore, you would have saw me turn around and the screen fade out. And, and then my game would crash because that, it's not it's not the right version to do that that Wait, storage what'd you thing. Say, Mario? I've got and thus Matt gave us the title for the episode. <laughs> He's not gonna repeat it. 
Here's your yeah. balloon, oh. booty, 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 booty. Welcome back to Booty Kong Racing. <laughs> 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 Where we go race booty triceratops on Booty Mountain, <laughs> and we gotta shoot him in the and we gotta shoot him in the booty with the rockets like we did last time. Okay, guys. Yep, I have okay. Well, now we have the title for sure. I'll give you a special prize. I think we'll need to rename all of the roars now. <laughs> Don't tempt him. <laughs> booty He's Kong Racing power. Part One, Two, Three, Four, Five, Six. Booty. <laughs> Heart race. Heart booty. Hey, I wasn't talking about that booty. I was talking about booty you get from a tre uh, treasure chest. That kind of. It booty. doesn't matter. You still made it work. <laughs> booty is booty. <laughs> booty is booty, Matt. And excuses are excuses. <laughs> Thank you. I've been trying to tell him this for the past year. And now I fear doing the Shantae play too, because when we get to that game, her shaking her booty. I'm afraid of what he's gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <sighs> I think I can breathe now. <laughs> now you got the hiccups. Yeah, I did something. Got it, gave him a hiccup. Wasn't anything good, mind you. Marley, do you really have the hiccups? No, I'm alright. Okay, I thought you had the hiccups for a second because I heard it. <gasps> Don't start. No, it's just giggles here on that. So is that the the boostless version of what yeah, you were talking that, about? That's last the maximum episode. boost that you can get from all three of the blue balloons. Yes, you do need to have that to make that shortcut and still get decent time. Some people just find that one just not worth taking in the second race and just skip it. Uh -oh. oh god! That was dangerously close. Oh, I almost fell off and uh -oh. I almost got oh, taken oh, over. Oh 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 oh! oh. Hey. The, false, the first boss fights aren't really anything bad because they're an introduction to the boss, you get the northern pattern, get the northern track. It's the second one where they go serious. So if you don't know what you're doing and you can't keep up, you're losing. Yay, we got to race the same levels again. Yeah, it's like the third time. Thank and, you, Mr. Tricep. And because we're racing these levels so many times, you'll see what I have to do to not make this redundant and it's all heck. We Marley, got a piece um, of the magical amulet. We need three more of these to actually go to the real final boss. Um, First Marley, one. In the last episode, I, I called that uh, Tricky's granddad. <laughs> TT on my way. Hey. Talk to you later. <laughs> so, to not be redundant, we're cutting these out. Bumped his night of victory. As oh, you can wait, tell, oh, there's a theme goodness. to all these messages. It's the same race as we did the first time. There's literally no points. I'm cutting these ones out. You okay. just have to have the most points at the end of the four races. Yeah, so basically tracks. if you win all the races, you're fine. Mm. Okay. So we have enough all balloons right. to do the next Thank race here with our much. genie friend. Right. We don't have a yes or no prompt? He's like, Jeez. I challenge you to a race. I don't want to go. Abracadabra. <laughs> I like a zap. I feel the hover cart's more. It's a little more difficult to use. It's a little more slippery, especially on ground. So I can agree. If you're holding down that R button to do a little drifting, it's easier to turn with. Ah. But even then, it's still pretty slippery. Yeah, everything else is fine. It's just this one's a little bit, a little difficult to work with. But I, I find the hovercraft my least favorite for that reason too. Like, I, I like the car, it's, you know, your standard car in a racing game, and the plane's really good because of the fact that you can fly around, it's really easy to control, but the hovercraft, it's not as comfortable. But it doesn't yeah. get used all that often, what's so it makes the, sense. What's the point of these races? Are you collecting the flags? No, the flags are pretty much just a guided area saying, go this way. If you go too far uh, out of know, the boundary of these flags, then you fail the race instantly. So they're pretty much you know, just keep you in bounds. I always wondered uh, if you had to cut the flags at first, too. But yeah, they just. They're just I didn't read idea. Them. I thought so as well, yeah. and I try to, but they disappear even if you're next to them. So it's just saying go around this area. And it's a lot better following the flags than just using the map. Yeah, especially in some points, like right here, it's really hard to see the map because white on light blue is really hard to see. Oh, yeah. 
and you just cut that corner anyway. And so. white on bright yellow is not hard. It's yeah, not hard and that, that's either. even worse. Yeah. Look at that. Oh jeez. <laughs> That's not too bad, but... Hey, I how did you tell I don't, cheater. Wait, man, if you can teleport, you could've won the race. Good. Man, you're dumb. You're dumb and you're a cheater. <laughs> I need salt horn on a hovercraft. Yeah, that's a great question. Especially because there's no place to press in for a horn. I'm guessing there's, like, a horn button on the actual joysticks. Okay, I should ask, hey, is salt horn a plane, or if that's... Or they do have horns on planes. Yeah, they do. So, again, uh, where's okay, it go? Oh, that's normal, then. Okay. Yep, that'll be how you do it. Next episode, card games on motorcycles. We already did riders. We did two of them.